SP Facilities and Maintenance, an out-of-the-box SharePoint template which can run in the cloud on Office 365 or on-premise. SP Facilities is part of the SP Business Suite and can be purchased with a suite or standalone. In this video, we will focus on SP Facilities demonstration. SP Facilities and Maintenance is a SharePoint application template that tracks facilities, assets within those facilities, contractors, workers, and maintenance staff, as well as work order processing and maintenance calendars. SP Facilities provides a site for the facility staff to track work order requests and manage assets and equipment. End users can use the employee portal within the site to submit and review facilities requests, access different resources and documents, and contact the facility staff. Specifically, it has a full featured service desk for managing tickets and work orders. It has an employee portal for employees to submit tickets and access services and resources. It has a full knowledge base for both end users and facility staff. It provides equipment and asset tracking and management. It also provides for change requests and periodic maintenance management. And finally, you can manage both contractors and vendors as part of the application. And for the facility staff, you can have task tracking, document management, and schedule tracking. The application is really set up as two portals in one. For the employees, there is a support portal which, from which they can see the status of different requests they've made as well as announcements and other information. For the facility staff, is a place that they can track different work order requests, asset information, vendor and contractor information as well. Let's take a look at the demonstration and see how you can turn your standard SharePoint implementation into a full featured facilities application. Welcome to the Facilities Department Template by SP Marketplace, built for Office 365. Like with many of our modules, it actually comes with an end-user portal that staff are automatically redirected to if they are not a member of the department's permission group. It is from here that end-users are able to put in a new work order to the facilities team. Follow up as to how those work orders are going. Search knowledge bases and even take a satisfaction survey. They can also see from here any important announcements, get access to documents and other links that the facilities team have made available to them. Within the facilities portal, maintenance staff are able to work on new work orders that have been put through, follow up on overdue work orders, put in new work orders themselves, see the announcements, see what maintenance is actually due, at which facility and when, is his, when it is due by. They can follow up on these work orders, assign them to other staff. They are also able to assign external contractors or non-Office 365 users to the work order in question. They are able to include other equipment in relation to the work order is what might be required. Follow up on all user correspondence. Add to the work log. Assign tasks and emails. And even create a change request if it's required for the work order. The facilities module also keeps a track of all the facilities utilized by the organization. You can even include images of the facility, as well as contacts and other pertinent information. And then you have the assets that are utilized at each of the individual facilities as well. You can keep a track of the staff, the asset vendors, organize change requests, you even have an area to store documentation that might be required, including things like site plans, which can be actually linked to the individual facility as well. Keep a track of equipment used and even utilize external contractors. The team also has its own 
work areas as well. To update the announcements, to add tasks outside of a work order or maintenance, you also have a team calendar to organize the important meetings and get-togethers. And these calendars also link to your Outlook as well. You can schedule staff, library for documents, and even have your own forum or discussion board as well. Plus, it has its own inbuilt dashboard too, so that you are able to see all the work orders by different categories, types and priorities, and even get breakdowns of those work orders as well. To learn more about this product or other SP Marketplace modules, go to spmarketplace.com. There you can sign up for a live demo for your entire team to see it, as well as see the other modules, videos, screen tours, and other resources that may be useful to you. spmarketplace.com